for the Lumberjacks as we get to the opening tip in Flagstaff. And it's won by the Lumberjacks for the radio listeners. The Lumberjacks going gold on gold with the dark blue Lumberjacks across the chest. And they're going to be going from left to right across your radio dial if you're listening in as Carson Taup throws it into the paint. It's going to be stolen right in the hands of Austin Smaley. Here come the Bengals. Orange on orange with the white Bengals across the chest. They're going right to left for the radio listeners as Burgeon penetrates to the elbow, kicks it out. Sorensen wants a three shot. It's an air ball, no good. Here come the Jacks back the other way. Cone on the left wing. Up top, Zeke Richards, transfer from Santa Clara. In the Zeke Richards, right block, he gets double team, fights through it, goes to the rim, can't finish, a little too strong, but Carson Taub right there to clean it up on the weak side in the paint with the offensive rebound and the stick back. 2-0, the lead for the Lumberjacks. Now it's the Bengals. Sorensen, bounce pass, right angle, three shot, Rodriguez, a little bit too strong, no good. And AU in transition. Lumberjacks love to run in transition, especially here in Flagstaff at 7,000 feet above sea level. Mains, ball fakes a three, down the tout, no look pass through the lane for a dunk for Zeke Richards. Outstanding pass from one of the best passing big men, as I mentioned in pregame in the Big Sky Conference, Carson Tout. Tout number seven in the Big Sky and assists per game, nearly four helpers per contest. Here's Burgeon. Sorensen, around the horn it goes into the hands of Smaley. Skip it over to Burgeon, corner. Step back on the baseline, little 15 footer. That hits the top of the backboard, I think, and comes no good. Rebounded by Nick Maines. Cone back the other way, four nothing to lead, NAU with the ball. Cone the tout, hands it back to Cone. Dribbles right, three shot, bang. Jalen Cone with the three point shot. And Idaho State wants a timeout at the 1748 mark of this basketball game. NAU jumps out to a quick seven to nothing lead. And head coach Ryan Looney, right there you can see the back of his head. There he is in the center of the huddle there. Third season. 27 wins, 52 losses, 16 and 35 the record for him in Big Sky Conference play. But he has 357 wins as a head coach in his career. He coached uh, three years at Point Loma Nazarene, seven years at Seattle Pacific, five years Eastern Oregon. D2 and NAIA ranks. There's Shane Burkhart, also in his third season. 31 and 48, the record for Shane Burkhardt. 19 and 31 at Big Sky Play. An accomplished and very successful Arizona high school coach. Mesa High School, the Jackrabbits, 12 seasons as head coach in the East Valley. 237 wins and a state championship in 2016. 7 0 to lead for NAU Burgeon. Dribble handoff to Sorensen. Back it goes to Burgeon. Rotated to Sorensen. Ten to shoot. Skip it out. Smaley, corner three shot, short from the left corner, no good. But nice rebound. Rodriguez throws one up from the baseline. That's no good. And rebounded by Carson Tout. Outlet to Jalen Cohn, and it's still 7-0 Lumberjacks off the high ball screen. Cohn pick and roll to Tout, out to the corner. Three shot, bang, Nick Mays. Nick Mays, the veteran on this team. His 110th career game as a Lumberjack. It's a 10-0 start for NAU. Coming into this game, a three-and-a-half point favorite over the Bengals. Sorensen on the left angle. Skips it over to Burgess. Right corner. He's got an open look at a three-shot. Too strong. Rebounded by Nick Maines and hands with the cone. 16-40 mark. 10-0 to lead for the Lumberjacks. Maines. The tout over on the short right corner. Answer the Cone, ball fakes the three. Throws it out front, Maines, he's got a straight line three shot, bang. Nick Maines, another three point shot. It's 13 to nothing now, the lead for NAU. Bengals looking for anything right now that would resemble a bucket, a point, something. Urgent off the ball screen to the right elbow. Bounces it out, Rodriguez rotated to Sorensen. He's got a good look at a three shot, that's in, bang. 
Sorensen gets the Bengals on the board at the 16-minute mark here at Flagstaff. The score now 13 to 3. As Cone walks it patiently across the timeline into the front court for NAU, and now the Lumberjacks spread out the court a little bit. Cone going ISO, drives, step back, deep one from the baseline. What was that? A big time step back for Jalen Cone. 15 to 3 to start for NAU. Urgent drew a handoff to Sorensen. Rotated over to Smaley, right angle. Smaley. Front Parker. Sorensen. Smaley drives baseline. Throws it out. Urgent. Fought about the three. Over to Rodriguez. Three shot from the right corner. That's no good. Rebounded by Ezekiel Richards of NAU. Lumper Jacks. Turned the ball over. 12 points per game, their leading score. Daxton Carr out of Pocatello, Idaho. He's also checked into the game along with Malik Porter, Phoenix product. Cesar Chavez High School. He's got the ball right now up top. Over to Sorensen, left angle. Down to Porter. He likes to post up smaller guys, except they bring it around and rotate it into the right corner. Three shot, Carr, short. Battle for the loose ball, one by Smaley, hustling. In the paint, triple team down low, and we got a whistle and a three-second violation in the lane. Our officials this evening are Doug Sturdivant, who just uh, blew the whistle on that three-second violation, Tim Marion, and Scott DeBoe. Mitch Stroman on the call for you on ESPN+. Plus. Thanks for joining us, Big Sky basketball fans, Bengal fans, Lumberjack fans on ESPN+. Plus here in Flagstaff, Arizona. Man, did we get a lot of snow yesterday up here. It was like 14, 15 inches, late February. NAU with the ball leading 15 to three, Cone with it up top, bounces a pass to Tout. Out in the corner to Jay Green, who's checked into the game. He drives into the lane, got a little bit out of control with the dribble and charging the call. Taking the charge, Daxton Carr of the Bengals. Turnover. There you see how Green drove from that right side through the lane. Carr getting himself set. Pocatello product Carr. Still 15 to three, Lumberjacks leading. We're at the 14-10 mark. First half in Flagstaff. Sorensen, ball screen Porter. Over to Cool, rotate it to Carr. Carr dumps it in, right block. Fight Porter, ripped out of his hands from behind. Defensively good defense in the paint for the Lumberjacks. I think it might have been Carson Tout who got that ball swept out of Porter's hand. Still 15 to three, and AU with the lead in the ball in the front court. 13-40 mark, first half. Tout drives, now backs out with the dribble. Pitches it out to Maines, three shot. Nick Maines, in and out, no good. Porter gets the rebound, hands it to Tarek Cool. Quick pass, up court to Smaley. The trailer Porter, now Sorensen left side. Sorensen. Swings a pass to Smaley. He lobs it in the Porter left block. They double on him. They throw it out and rotate it to Cool. Jab steps and goes it to Smaley. Smaley, three shot. Hits the back of the rim and it's rebounded by Jay Green who got up high in traffic for the defensive board. Green, no look pass. Trying to jet one down the lane to Zeke Richards. Gets tipped out of bounds. Scott DeBoe, official on the baseline, says that was tipped by him. And so it'll be Idaho State ball as Zeke Richards comes out of the game. Isaiah Lewis checks in for NAU. Also checking in, Jaden Jackson for the Lumberjacks along with Keith Heyman. Jackson hasn't played since February 7th at Northern Colorado. He's been nursing a bum wheel. He's back out on the court. Getting his first action in a couple of weeks. 15 to three, Lumberjacks leading. We're at the 13 minute mark of the first half. Bengals with the ball in the front court. Radio listeners, they're going right to left. Here's Cool off the ball screen from Porter. He wants Porter down there. Short corner left. Banging in on Jackson. Tries to kind of swing around Jackson in the paint. Go to the rim. Draws a blocking foul against Jaden Jackson. Out comes Austin Smaley for the Bengals. And in checks in A.J. Bergen. Cool on the baseline. Will inbound. Tarek Cool, baseball pass, throws it into the backcourt. Get that ball in before the five-second violation. Sorensen chases it down. And 
Dribbles off the ball screen to the left angle. Bergen, right corner, three shot, air ball. Chased down by Jackson. Here comes Jaden Jackson in the lumber. Jackson transition. Jackson picks it up up top. Still 15-3. It's been uh, quiet offensively since the quick 15-point start for NAU. Traveling violation. Another Lumberjack turnover. Turnovers have been the bane of the Lumberjacks this season. NAU coming into the game, averaging nearly 14 turnovers per game in their 16 Big Sky Conference games. That's worst in the league. Already at five. Sorensen bounces at the porter, short corner left. He's working in on Tout, gets into the key. Use that right hand, spins it in the cylinder off of the left block. Just a little push shot for Malik Porter. Again, out of Cesar Chavez High School. Phoenix. A mini 5 0 run here for the Bengals, and the score is 15 5 Lumberjacks. Here's Heyman, driving. Runs into traffic, Daxton Carr and company, and another turnover. Six turnovers now for the Lumberjacks. Step back, Sorensen, three shot, bang. Sorensen with the triple. And the Bengals have been uh, kind of chipping away slowly at the Lumberjack 15-0 lead. NAU scoreless in their last four minutes, 15 seconds. Here's Jay Green. Out to Jackson, in the tout. Mid post left side of the lane. Hands it back to Heyman, curling. And Cone and Mason Stark. See who we've got come out here for the Bengals. Anybody new? Nope, looks like the same group of five. 15-8. NAU leading, just under the 11 minute mark. Porter picks it up, angle right. Hands it back to Cool. Smaley. Carr, left way, 10 to shoot, in the Porter. He's going to try to bang in on Zeke Richards. Left block, spins around him, gets to the rim. A little too strong, but he gets his own miss. Then he goes up with it, and that's swatted out big time by Zeke Richards. Transition, Heyman drives, pulls up a little four-footer from the baseline, left side, and knocks it down. And the Lumberjacks get a bucket for the first time in well, more than five minutes. And a flop warning has been issued against the Bengals' Austin Smaley. 17 to eight, the Lumberjack lead. We're rolling down to the 10 minute mark in Flagstaff. Cool wants a three shot left side, bang! Tarek Cool. Came into the game with 1,014 career points for the Bengals. Knocks down a triple. Cool's first points of the game. He's their leading scorer at about 12 per. 17 to 11, Lumberjack lead. Richards hands it to Cohn. Back to Richards, little two-man action. Richards, the finger roll at the rim, good. Two-man basketball, Cohn and Zeke Richards, 19 to 11. Now the lead. 940 mark, first staff. Here's Burgett. Smaley gets double teamed outside of the left block. They rotate it out. He's got a good look at a three shot up top. It goes off the iron, no good. Tapped in though by Malik Porter, crashing the offensive glass for the Bengals. And the Bengals, after trailing 15 nil, will start this one. And trim the lead now to a couple of possessions. 19 to 13 the score. And AU with the lead. Nick Baines with it, mid post left side. Get in on Carr, little step back. Mid-ranger, short, no good, off the rim, rebounded by Carr, good defense by Carr on Nick Maines. Nine minute mark, 19-13 the lead. Here's a three shot, bang, and Idaho State University. 19-16, the Lumberjacks as Jalen Cohn walks it across the timeline, met by Mr. Smaley. Right elbow, tout. Hands it back to Cohn. Cone with the dribble. Gets at the tout, goes through his fingertips, but Keith Heyman there to pick him up. Heyman back to tout, in the paint, in the left corner. Three shot, Nick Mains, air ball, into the hands of A.J. Burgeon. San Diego product. Burgeon up court quickly to Carr. Left wing, three shot, bang, we're tied. 19-19 the score. Yikes. 
Bengals now on an eight nothing run over about 67 seconds. And after a 13 to nothing start for the Lumberjacks. Here's Heyman. And it to Cone. Smaley tight on the Big Sky's second leading score. Two shot, two to shoot. A little bit of a prayer from Zeke Richards. Falls off the iron, no good. Bengals could take their first lead of the contest with this possession. 7.35, Markul, deep three shot. Hits the back of the iron, goes way up high in the air. Rebounded by Zeke Richards of NAU to Cone. Cone weaving his way into the front court, through the lane, pitches it out to Maines. Thought about a three, gets it to Heyman from the left elbow. Keith Heyman, too strong, no good. Ball right town where this building is in, where you're watching. Welcome back, everyone. Flagstaff, Arizona, 1919, the score. Idaho State, NAU, tied at the 715 mark, first half. Mitch Stroman on the call for ESPN Plus. Jalen Cohn bounces it into Tau. Tau looking. Now on Carr, eight to shoot, out to Heyman. In the lane, step back. Lane too strong, no good. Ball's tipped around and Sorensen chases it down. Sorensen out of Denmark. He's hot. This guy right here with the ball. 16.3 points per game his last three. Cool in the Sorensen. They double on him. Out to Cool. Fakes it right, then goes right. Smaley, three shot. Bang! Austin Smaley out of Preston, Idaho at 10 points against the Lumberjacks, back, way back. And these two teams played each other in Pocatello back in early December of last year. Tout with it at the free throw line. Out to Heyman, three shot, short. Chased down by Carson Tout. Bengals leading 22 to 19. Lumberjacks with the ball. 11 nothing run for Idaho State. Here's Tout in the key. Goes to the rim with the right hand, and it spins out of the cylinder. A little bit too much English on that one. Bengals in transition, running, cool. Pitches it back out to the trailer car for a three shot, bang. Bengals rolling right now, 14 to nothing run over the last three and a half minutes. And they've grabbed a 25 to 19 lead. Lumberjacks on another scoring drought of nearly four minutes as Smaley fouls Cone on the deck way outside of the arc. Jay Burkar sends out that guy, the lefty Isaiah Lewis, to replace Zeke Richards. You see there, going to take a seat on the Lumberjack side of the bench. In the cone, 5.40 to go until intermission. 25-19 the lead. Here's a three shot. Heyman. That rolls over the rim, no good. Rebounded by Isaiah Lewis. Little left-handed jump hook, too strong, no good. Rebounded by Tout, out to Nick Maines. Three shot corner, in and out, no good. Lumberjacks can't buy a bucket. Rebounded by the Bengals. So many games for NAU this year have seen long stretches of zero point scored, scoring droughts in the game. This is one of them. This is gonna be a turnover, backcourt violation on the errant pass. And I think head coach Shane Burkar of Northern Arizona has made a kind of an argument that, hey, wait a minute. My guy had that ball. He was going to go run and get a dunk. Lumberjacks will get the ball and inbound it in the front court. Trailing 25 to 19, thanks to a 14 to nothing run by the Bengals. It's the Gobi Desert right now for scoring for NAU. More than four and a half minutes without a point. It's dry, parched. Here's Cone. They got a whistle and a foul being called. Great Parker got caught. Picks up the foul. Our officiating crew tonight not blowing the whistle too often here early. Letting the game develop a little bit of a natural flow to it. Tout out to Lewis. To Heyman. Oh, he pitched it. Looking left. Threw it left. And Nick Maines, who wasn't looking back at Heyman for the ball. And that's a turnover. That is eight turnovers now for the Lumberjacks. Keith Heyman. 
think for Heyman, that is his fourth turnover. So he takes a seat on the bench. And it looks like Jaden Jackson's checked in now. Also coming in, Jared Rodriguez. Here's Cool. Cool's a player. Not afraid to take tough shots. Out front, rotate it. Smaley. Smaley. Over to Rodriguez. Right angle. Three shot. In and out. No good. Oh, ping pongs around. Goes right through several lumberjacks into the hands of Sorensen. Idaho State, fresh 20. Cool. Ball fakes the three. Drives. There's the floater teardrop. It's good. Tarek Cool. Drop and rain. Little short floater. 27 of the 19. It's a 16 to nothing run now. NAU scoreless for more than five and a half minutes. Here's Cole. That gets batted out. That was... Lumberjacks will inbound on the front court. We got 27 19 to score. Here's Cone off the high ball screen. Oh, his three shot was tipped and blocked. Bengals in transition. Porter gets a deep catch and right to the rim from inside of the right block finishes. And the run continues to be explosive for the Bengals. 18 0. 29 19 the lead. And AU with the ball. Cone with it up top. Over to Lewis, left angle. Crossover, drives down to that left block, gets cut off by Porter. 10 to shoot, he's in the lane, goes up and under, gets double teamed, gets cut off, and I think he had a three second violation. And Burkhardt looking for answers right now as the Lumberjacks continue to look for points. Think about this for a minute. We're at the 314 mark, right? And the Jacks have had two scoring droughts of five or more minutes already in the first half with three to go. Smaley leans one in with the right hand. That's too strong. And Carson Tout gets the position and rebounds. It. Still 29, the 19, the Bengals. Under three to go in the first half in Flagstaff. Here's Maines out front looking left, then dribbles right. Gets it to Jackson. Bounces it into Tout. Right block gets underneath the basket. Gets double teamed by Rodriguez. Ball gets poked out of his hands on the baseline. And it will be off of Tout. That's a turnover. He could have also stepped on the baseline, potentially. A little hard to see from my particular angle. But here's the one thing I can say for sure, fans. It's a turnover. Jaden Jackson comes out. Isaiah Lewis comes out. Zeke Richards comes in. Keith Heyman comes back in for NAU and the Lumberjacks now sport 10 turnovers. Uh, about two and a half to go in the first half. Cool, baseline drive, whistle, foul call. You know, but you just look at numbers, basketball is a lot like baseball in this way, lots of fun numbers to play with. 17 to nothing lead in bench points for the Bengals. Here's a three shot from the corners. Missed no good by Smaley. Tip up attempt by Porter because a little bit off. Here come the Lumberjacks looking for points. Here's Cone driving. Up and under to the rim. Finishes. It's good and one. Put him on the line. That breaks a nearly seven and a half minute scoring drought for NAU and Boyd and they need this. Right there, the leader in traffic. Cone Taking control a little bit on that possession as Burgett comes in for the Bengals. At the line, Jalen Cohn, top free throw shooter on the Lumberjacks at about 85%. Knocks it down, three point play for Mr. Cohn. He has eight points tonight. It's now 29 to 22 Bengals. Around the 210 mark, first half. Skip pass. Burgett, left corner, drives. Gets cut off on the block, gets it to Porter. Back out Burgeon. Tout on him, back to Porter. Tend to shoot. Porter gets down underneath the basket. Little pump fake action on Zeke Richards and finishes at the rim. Nice move by Malik Porter. 31-22 the lead for the Bengals. About a buck 45 to go until halftime. Here's Cohn up top. True offensive foul call. You can see that one coming. Both officials on the sidelines, both whistling the same thing. Keith, let's see, that one was called on. 
Zeke Richards. One, Mason, Stark. Mason Stark comes in from Richards. Stark, the Division II transfer out of Northern State University in Aberdeen, South Dakota. About 135 to go till halftime. 31 to 22, the Bengal lead. Here's Sorensen. Rotating it around the perimeter. Cool with the jab step motion. Porter gets in deep. Goes to the rim, finishes, and draws a foul. Score it and put him on the line. The foul's going to be called against the Lumberjacks, Keith Heyman. They see number 30, Keith Heyman, right there. On our baseline camera shot. Daxton Carr comes in now for the Bengals and Malik Porter to the line. Porter struggling a little bit at the line this season, 52% at the line. Two years he played at the College of Southern Idaho. Oh, big high arc or good rotation on it. Drops the free throw in, good. 34 to 22 to lead. And Idaho State, a little pressure on the inbound pass with the backcourt. 115 to go until halftime. And AU with the ball. Bengals on a 23 to three run. 23 to three. Skip it out. Mains driving. Now it's Stark, he drives. Gets cut off, out to Maines. He drives to the free throw line, out to Heyman, catch and shoot, three shot. Off the iron, no good, and a whistle on the loose ball. Foul gonna be called. Now this was going against who? Malik Porter. Malik Porter. 56 seconds to go until halftime. Coming up at halftime, stay tuned everybody. I'll have the uh, halftime report on ESPN Plus. We'll Separate out the radio simulcast. Dave Zorn will have our halftime report on the Lumberjack Radio Network. Inbound to Tout. Now to Stark. Circles around, goes to the rim. Finger roll finish. It's good. Mason Stark. Came to this program with a reputation as a very good three-point shooter, but he has been driving the cup lately for several games. Showing that he wants to get to the rim. Parker, banging in on Tout. Left-handed jump hook off the glass. Bank shot, no good. Ball's loose, getting in the hands of Cone. And AU down 10. Shot clock is turned off now. 20 seconds to go. Cone steps into the center circle near the half-court line. And AU spreads out the court. The rolling time, looking for a last shot. Trailing 34-24. Cone, between the legs, drives. Kick out, Mains steps inside the arc. Three seconds to go. Jump shot off, no good. Rebounded by Dax Kakar. And first possession starts the second half. They will now be traveling from left to right across the radio dial if you're dialed in. Audio only. There's Porter. He gets a start in the second half. So does Cool. Right corner. Three shot. Big arcer. No good. Rebound, Nick Mains. Bumper Jacks for radio listeners. Going right to left. 34-24 the lead, low scoring first half between two teams that are low scoring this season, both of them. Number nine and number 10 of the Big Sky Conference is scoring. Here's curling, three shot, Cone spins out of the cylinder, no good, rebounded by Daxton Carr. Carr getting the start in the second half as well. Only Sorensen and Smaley who we're on the original starting five for head coach Ryan Looney get the start in the second half. That's a turnover. Haven't been many of those for the Bengals. Cone attacking, little floater, drops it good. Jalen Cone coming into the game. Nobody other than one person in the big sky scores more than he does. He's number two in the league in scoring. Porter spins, reverse layup, comes off the iron, no good. And Cohn attacking again, pitches it out. Corner, three shot, Heyman, bang! Keith Heyman in the left corner. Lumberjacks Jacks come out firing a little bit on both ends of the court, defense and offense. Trim the 10 point lead, down the five. Bengals with the ball, Storenson. Here's Porter, back out Smaley, back to Porter. Back out Smaley, 10 to shoot. Sorensen. 
out to Cool. The Porter, four to shoot. Oh, and a whistle with four, three seconds on the shot clock. Zeke Richards picks up the Lumberjacks' first team foul of the second half. Fresh 20 for Idaho State. As Mr. Cool on the baseline, look at. Skipping it over to Smaley and a touch pass to Carr. Three shot Carr, bang. Braxton Carr, Pocatello product. Cal Poly transfer out of the Mustangs program. One season there, 25 games, 12 starts. Highland High School in Pocatello. Got the Bengals on the board. We're at the 17-37 mark. It scores 37-29 Idaho State. Top with it outside of the left block. No look pass to Nains and a pocket pass down low to Zeke Richards for the dunk. Seven to three start for the Lumberjacks of the second half as Cool gets cut off and swings it out to Sorensen over to Smaley. Three shot. Bang. Austin Smaley. Box down the triples. Nine points. He's got three threes. We're three minutes in to the second half, and it's a 40 to 31 lead. The Bengals found that answer. Cone. Nice move, but an air ball into the hands of Tout, who saves it to Heyman. Goes downhill through the lane. Another pocket pass down to Zeke Richards, who can't finish. Gets the loose ball. We've got a whistle being called on that battle for the loose ball. And this will go against Daxton Carr of Idaho State. On shooting foul. So Nick Maines will inbound on the baseline. Throws it into Cone, left corner. Drives on Carr. Ball poked out, he recovers it. Out to Maines. Back to Cone. Pull up mid ranger. Knocks it down. That was about a 15, 16 footer. Jalen Cone may be finding a little offensive rhythm here in the second half. He now has a dozen points, and we got a whistle. What they were looking at was to see if the player was in the act of shooting when he was fouled by Zeke Richards. They determined that he was not in the act of shooting, so not shooting foul. And Idaho State inbounds. They've got the ball and the lead, 40 to 33. Smaley can't finish up at the rim and ripping down the defensive rebound, Keith Heyman for NAU. In transition, Heyman thought about the three. It's it back to his point guard, Jalen Cohn. 15-55 marks, second half in Flagstaff, Arizona, 40 to 33. It's the lead for the Bengals. Jay Green with it, out front between the circles, driving down the left side of the lane, attacking the rim, finishing at the rim, and one. Put him on the line. Green, the lefty, draws the foul on Porter, who was kind of chasing Green down the lane. And Green will go to the line. Green from Sydney, Australia, but played high school in Phoenix. Hillcrest Prep High School, the Bruins. They averaged 26 points per game. That's pretty good. Mountain Ridge High School, the Mountain Lions, where he was D1 second team All-State. Also played some rugby. Misses the free throw, though. 40 to 35. Bengals leading the Lumberjacks with the ball. Sorensen, out front car to Smaley. He wants a three shot. Back of the iron, no good. Back tapped out to Smaley. Fresh 20 for the Bengals. Here's Tarek Cool. He's backing down. Cone. Ball poked out of his hands, and he kicks it out to Sorensen on the left side. 10 to shoot. Deep three shot. Back of the iron, no good. It goes out of bounds into the Bengal bench, and it'll be Lumberjack basketball. As we look at head coach Shane Burkar and now Carson Tout. Five-point lead for Idaho State. 15-minute mark, second half. Skydo, Flagstaff, Big Sky Conference basketball on ESPN+. Plus. Here's Cohn circling around with it. Out front to Mains, throws it left. Tend to shoot the green. Now to Tout. Back 
to Green, five to shoot. Green gets cut off, out to Heyman, two to shoot, three shot off the left side of the rim, no good. Kind of a desperation three for Nick Keith Heyman. Rebounded by the Bengals, they're up five with the ball. Here's Smaley, left side, three shot, too strong. And knocked into the hands of Cone by Nick Maines. We are going to have a blocking foul on Daxton Carr as Cone was bringing the ball up court. Jared Rodriguez into the game for Carr. Rodriguez, much traveled, started in University of San Diego, the Toreros. 43 games, two seasons there. They went to Idaho, the Bengals, or the uh, Vandals, pardon me. Oh, the floater in the lane. Cone, good. Well, what do you know? It's now a one possession game again. And AU has chipped away. Lumberjacks on a 6 0 run. Parker wants a three shot. Bang. Braden Parker, 27% from deep coming into the game. Knocks down a, a three shot. That stops the run for the Lumberjacks. It's now 43 to 37 Bengals. And AU with the ball, 13-39 mark. Cone, three shot. Off the left side of the rim, no good. Rebounded by Rodriguez, and he gets it to Cool. Cool finds the trailer, and now they set up in the half court. Cool with it. Left angle. Oh, bounce pass into Rodriguez. Kind of went right through the wickets. Or check that, Brayton Parker. And it'll be a turnover. As Keith Heyman comes out. Zeke Richards comes in. Mason Stark has come into the game. A.J. Burgeon comes in. Forty-three to thirty-seven, the Bengals are leading the Lumberjacks. Here comes Jalen Cohn across the timeline, walking it up court into the front court. Dribble out between the circles, driving down the right side of the key, gets cut off, throws it out to Nick Maines up top. Now over to Green, left wing, Zeke Richards, Parker on him. He bangs in on Parker in the in the lane. He goes right-handed jump hook, rolls over the front of the iron, drops in good. Richards has eight points tonight. 43-39 the lead. Virgin in the Parker. Right block, now he's working in on Zeke Richards. In the lane, left-handed jump hook, in and out, no good. Tapped out though nicely to Virgin for a three shot. Bang! Second chance opportunity turned into a successful three shot, and it's now a 46 to 39 lead. Cone wants to drive again down the lane, running to the rim, off the glass, drops in good with the layup. 46 to 41 the lead. Underneath, Parker got behind everybody, got an easy. California in the nest on the campus of Sacramento State. Those games, of course, in the Pacific time zone. Here at Flagstaff, Mitch Drobin with you, 48 to 41. Idaho State leading NAU, 11.55 mark. Second half, NAU with the ball. Green in the front, between circles, driving, going to the rim. Left-handed layup, might have been tipped a little bit by Parker. Missed it, no good. And up court, Green is going to be whistled. Jalen Cohn and company starting to feel it a little bit. Cohn now with 16 points. He's 7-11 from the, from the deck. 7 of 11 from the deck, I can speak. 1 of 4 from deep. Here's a deep shot. Rodriguez, no good on the three shot. Rebounded by Jay Green. And AU down 48 to 41. Trailer, Heyman to Green. Into the lane to Tau. Spins. Uh oh. That might have been a foul or a travel. Let's see what we got. Foul. Liam Sorensen, I believe, was whistled for the foul. Team foul number four. Tarek Cool's going to get up off of Ryan Looney's bench and replace Sorensen, who picked up his first personal. Seven point lead for the Lumberjack or for the Bengals over the Lumberjacks, 48 to 41. And AU to inbound. Tout, short corner left. Kick out. 
Hey, Nick Maines, three shot, spins out of the cylinder, no good. As Malik Porter grabs the rebound, and the Bengals come back up in transition, leading 48 to 41 with just about 11 minutes to go in regulation here at Flagstaff. Bergen to Cool. Works off a ball screen, wants a deep three. Back of the iron, high bounce, no good. Rebounded and chased down by Keith Heyman. To Cone. Behind the back dribble to the Taylor Heyman. Over to Maines, right corner, three shot. Oh, short. That goes out of bounds on the baseline. It'll be given to the Bengals. Maines had a good look in that corner three shot, but it was short. Daxton Carr right there coming into the game. Biology major. Three games against the Lumberjacks in his career with the Bengals. Carr, who is a 6'7", 215-pound, third-year sophomore transfer. has averaged about seven per game against NAU. He has nine tonight. Here's Cool with it, right angle. They double on Cool, trapping it. Rip the ball from him, and a whistle. And a foul going to be called against Jay Green. And as you can clearly see by the facial expressions and the lip movement of one Jay Green right there, he is uh, not happy with the call. He felt like that they were able to affect a steal. And he's staying in the game with three fouls. But the NAU down seven, 10-15 mark. Smaley. Working on Heyman. That's blocked. NAU gets the ball. Here comes Cone racing up court. Cone to the trailer mains. Left wing. Three shot. Bang! Nick Maines knocks down the three point shot. He has three of those tonight. Nine points. 48 to 44. Bengal lead. As that pass into the post to Porter is denied by Carson Tout. There's Tout. Him and Porter have been battling pretty, pretty physically. Down in the paint, a couple of physical ball players. Very emotional, too. Green pokes it out of the hands of Cool. Now Cool drives Green. Now here's something that's interesting is Green gets whistled for the foul. Bet you didn't know this one. They're both from Arizona. They may have faced each other at some point in high school, these two guys, number two and number zero. Cool out of Chandler, Jay Green, Mountain Ridge High School and Hillcrest Prep. Cool to the line. Free throw good. 9.31 mark as Green comes out and Jaden Jackson checks in. Every time NAU has made a bit of a run here at Idaho State, and got it down at one point to one possession, Bengals have found a way to respond. There's the response right there from Mr. Cool. It's back up to six points, the lead. Just under nine and a half to go. 50 to 44, NAU with the ball, but trailing. Goes the cone attack, now to Tout in the lane. Out the mains, three shot. Bang! Nick to 47. Now it's a one possession lead. Let's see if Idaho State responds again. Here's Carr, lobs it in the short corner left, Porter. And on Tout. Left hand, little right-handed jump hook. It's off the mark, no good. Rebounded by Jackson, and here comes Cohn. He's racing to the rim. Gets cut off to the trailer mains. Three shot, short. Ooh! Wow. Jaden Jackson went flying for the save on the loose ball on the baseline. Man, that looked like it hurt. Sounded like it hurt. Watch this dive right here. Boom. Great hustle. True freshman right there out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Jackson. As we see Mr. Sorensen check back into the game and replace Burgeon.
Coaches will take hustle like that every day of the week. Here's a catch and shoot corner, three shot. And goes over the rim, no good. And I think Jalen Cone may have possibly stepped on the sideline. That would be a turnover. Still a one possession lead for Idaho State at the 830 mark, 50 to 47, but Bengals with the ball in the front court. Porter, high post this time, over to Sorensen. Porter and Sorensen playing some two-man action. There's Porter down low, can't finish in the paint, rebounded Tout. Cone doesn't have numbers. It was one on three. He waits for help, gets the trailer. Jackson, three shot. Back of the iron, no good. Rebounded by Carr. That would have tied the game if that had dropped in. Still 50 to 47. Bengals with the lead. Porter going downhill to the rim. Layup good from Malik Porter. And there's the answer. Just when it was getting close to being tied. Bengals get a bucket. Extend that lead out now to two possessions. Tout wants to drive. He gets double teamed. He's trapped. Cool gets him. Here comes Carr. Then uh, we'll be playing Weber State on Saturday, senior day, in the Sky Dome. And then next Thursday at Eastern Washington. Here's Tout. Working the lane. That little left handed jump hook drops in. Good. Carson Tout. He's been grabbing him off the glass tonight. Not scoring much until that one. That puts him up to four points. 52 to 49. Guess what? One possession lead again for the Bengals. Will they answer? Here's Cool. A little fade away from the free throw line. Oh, rebounded by Carr. Goes to the rim. And a foul's going to be called, I presume, in the act of shooting. Carson Tout, like I mentioned, grabbing him off the glass. He has 10 rebounds tonight already along with four assists tout this is what i believe his there it is ninth 10 plus rebound game this season tied for fourth in the big sky conference and 10 or more games where he has had uh, or 10 or games where he has had 10 or more rebounds tout coming into the game averaging just under nine boards per game for the season Number two in the conference in that category. But he's also in the top ten in assists and assist to turnover ratio as Daxton Carr drops the first free throw in good. Carr a 55% free throw shooter this season. That guy right there played some football in high school for Highland High School at Pocatello. Also won a 5A state championship. Second free throw good. There's your answer. Mason Stark comes in for Jaden Jackson. 7.03 mark, second half here in Flagstaff in the walk-up Sky Dome. 54 to 49, the lead for the Bengals. NAU with the ball. Just a little bit of pressure on that inbound. Here's Cone. Cone has 16 points tonight off the high ball screen. Over to Nick Maines. High post out. He loves that spot. Into the lane, pump fakes. Over to Stark, mid-range, short, no good. To Tout, that's rebound 11 to Heyman. No look pass down to Nick Maines, cutting to the basket off the weak side. It goes through his hands and a turnover. Sorensen brings it up himself. Cool on the left angle. 624 mark, 54 to 49, Bengal lead. Sorensen. Skips it over to Carr. Three shot. Carr. Nope. Rebounded by Porter momentarily. As Doug Sturdivan blows the whistle, we're going to have a foul on the loose ball. Second foul of the evening for Keith Heyman of the Lumberjacks. Bengals have made one of their last eight shots from the deck. NAU has outscored Idaho State by five in the second half down 10 at halftime, and Porter back to the line. Porter, one of one at the line tonight. 13 points, five boards, can't make that first one no good, no bonus, rebounded by Keith Heyman. 
Mains thought about the three, but Carr got back on him. Mains gets a ball screen from Tout to Stark. Mid post right side. Tout now to Cohn. Mid range shot drops in good. Jalen Cohn. 18 points tonight for Mr. Cohn. Just a smidge below his season average of 18 and a half. Oh, Euro stepping down the baseline into the paint for the layup corner. Good, that was big time. There's an answer. Every time NAU has climbed into that position to tie or take the lead, Bengals have had an answer. It's now 56 to 51. Bengals, Cone, crossover. Working on Smaley over to Heyman. Corner, three shot, in and out, no good. Rebounded by Porter. Five minute mark, second half. Five point lead, the Bengals. And they have the ball in the front court. Around the arc, they pass it. Here's Cool. Thought about the pick and roll, but they blow it up on the hedge. NAU defensively, ball goes off of Nick Maines out of bounds, and it'll be Bengal ball with seven seconds on the shot clock. In comes Rodriguez. The Bengals led at half by 10. Under third year head coach Ryan Looney, ISU 24 and 6, 6 and 3 this season when they carry a lead into the locker room at halftime. Here's Parker with that little jump hook from the short corner on the left baseline, the left hand good. Fifty-eight to fifty-one. Stark to Cone. 15 to shoot, ball screen, Tout, circles over to the right side, tries to get in the Tout on the pick and roll. Tout and Rodriguez get tangled up. Rodriguez goes down, helps up Tout. Good sportsmanship from both players. And Tout whistled for the foul at the 4.15 mark of the second half, and NAU down 58 to 51. Idaho State is in the bonus at the 4.15 mark. Meanwhile, the Bengals have fouls to give. This will be one and one for Jared Rodriguez. He's a 79% free throw shooter. <laughs> 31 starts in Moscow, Idaho, Rodriguez, as we see Bergen come in for cool. Play the season at Idaho, transferred to Idaho State. Free throw good, bonus coming. Rodriguez, who's been hot, hot, hot. Watch the tangle up here. That, ouch. That doesn't feel good on the knee, the ankle, the shin. Pretty much everywhere on the leg. Rodriguez, 15 points per game in his last three, including a Idaho State career high, 27. On 10 of 15 shooting in the Monday night loss with the Bengals in Greeley, Colorado against the Bears of Northern Colorado. 60 to 51 the lead. Maines steps to the right, three shot. Bang! Nick Maines creates his own space and knocks a triple down. Four minutes to go. 60 to 54 the lead. Kick out. Burgett, corner, three shot, in and out, no good. Rebounded by Stark. 3.45 to go. And now you trying to get back into this. Here's Heyman, three shot, left side, too strong. Rebound, Smaley. Six point lead, the Bengals. The visitors, three and a half point underdogs tonight. Skip over to Burgeon. Now in the Smaley. Working Heyman. Leans in on him, can't get that layup to go. Rebounded by Stark. Here's another opportunity for NAU. Cone rejects the ball screen, goes to the rim. High off for Steve Lumberjacks. Jalen Cone going to the line. One of one at the free throw line. 18 points. First one's good.
Cone's been struggling a little bit offensively. 15 points per game his last seven. He's averaging 18 and a half for the season. Here's the second free throw. It's good. Now, that's 20 points for Cone. That's his 12th 20-point or more game this season that ties him for with the great three-point shooter for NAU several years ago, Steve Sir, with 12 20-point or more games in a single season. The record 16, by the way, held by Cameron Jones, the Lumberjacks' all-time leading scorer. 60 to 56. Cool with it. Left angle. 2.45 to go. Bengals with the lead. Oh, Stark coming over the top of Rob Sorensen. Steal. Heyman stepped on the line, turned it over. <laughs> 2 38 to go in a four point game and a turnover off of a turnover. Lumberjacks were trailing at the three-minute mark. NAU 3-18 this season. 9-46 under head coach Shane Burkhardt trailing at the three-minute mark. Here's Sorensen in the porter, attacking to the rim. Banks it off the glass. It's good. That was a big bucket. 62-56, the Idaho State lead. Cone with 20 points. Pull up from the baseline, it's short, no good, and Idaho State's cool with the ball. Under two to go. Up, 62 to 56. Idaho State came into this game tonight having won five consecutive games against the Lumberjacks and Flagstaff. They're going for six straight. They're moving the ball around the arc, wasting time off the clock. Carr, nine to shoot. Over to Sorensen, they are really gonna roll the time off. Five to shoot, Sorensen. Jets it in the Porter. Porter cannot finish, but gets his own missed shot and goes back up to it, sticks it back in. That basket's even bigger. 1.23 to go. Bengals a game and a half behind the Lumberjacks in the Big Sky Conference standings, looking to pick up a full game and split the season series. Here's Cone, pull up. Yes! And it's a foul and a... Yes, it's a foul. And he'll go to the line. Jalen Cone. With 22 points, draws a foul. There, there it is, Smaley running out, jumping into Cone. Cone knocked the shot down. He'll go to the free throw line for a three-point play opportunity to keep the Lumberjacks' heartbeat going. 64 to 58 is the score. Here's the free throw from Cone. Knocks it down. Five point the deficit for the Lumberjacks, five point the lead for the Bengals. Now they're gonna try to trap Idaho State in the backcourt. Time rolling away, 65 seconds to go. Cool and Idaho State spread out the court, no roll time. Under a minute to play. Derek Cool, meandering there outside of the arc, near midcourt with the ball, 10 to shoot, wasting the time down. Rejects the ball screen, five to shoot. Gets in the lane, falls down almost, gets it to Smaley. Smaley with one second to go, launches the shot. Oh, rebounded by Malik Porter, and he's fouled by Carson Tout. Porter with a gigantic offensive rebound off the weak side. That is the 11th offensive rebound for Idaho State. Even though they're losing overall on the glass, 37-31. The 11th offensive rebound, that was a big one. Porter will go to the line. One and one. That was the ninth team foul. 39 seconds to go. Five point lead, the Bengals. Porter free throw up. Falls off, no good, no bonus. Rebounded by NAU, they're alive. Up to Heyman. Heyman, driving. Knocks down the tout. Tout, layup with the left. Going to try to force a turnover here. The clock is the enemy of the home team. Cool runs the baseline. He's allowed to do that. Now he's in the backcourt. About a half a second difference game and shot. Up court to Smaley. And there's the foul. Stop. 21.2 seconds to go with second free throw. NAU down four. Buries them both. Five point deficit. NAU has to hustle. Don't need a three. Just need a two. Cone to Stark. 
Stark, a little floater, drops in, there's the two. 13.2 seconds to go. And AU has one timeout left. Down now, 66 to 63, down to a possession. Carr into the backcourt to get it in. Foul going to be called, Liam Sorensen. Sorensen, who's been playing very well lately, will have a double bonus. He's a good free throw shooter, 71% this season. Sorensen, who's from Denmark, played for the Danish U16 national team. Foul was called on Stark, his first, but it's double bonus. With 10.8 seconds to go and a three-point lead. Lumberjacks need Sorensen to uh, uncharacteristically miss two, but they won't get that. Sorensen makes his first one. Now a two-possession lead. With just under 11 seconds to play in Flagstaff. Sorensen's second free throw. Oh, that's clutch. Clutch. Team that shoots 69% at the line. They're 85% in this game. Here's Cone. Got to hustle. Nine seconds. Here's a deep three. Bang! Timeout. Around the court at 55%. But unlikely he's going to get the pass. Cool. Running the baseline. Throws it in. Gets it to Smaley. And they foul him quickly. One second goes off the clock. Smaley will go to the line. Two shots. Now, Austin Smaley has not attempted a free throw tonight. For the season, 74%. Smaley has nine points. He's averaged 10 points per game against the Lumberjacks in seven career games against NAU. His first free throw bangs in the cylinder, comes and goes through. 5.6 seconds to go. It's now a one possession lead still, 69 to 66. This free throw right here is a biggie. This one is a big one. Smaley. Oh, that's clutch again. 5.6 seconds to go, four point lead. In the cone, four seconds, three seconds, cone. Into the lane, lost the ball, turns it over, and that will do 